Okay, y'all got that, honey. Prince, okay. Kiss. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey, I doing? How you doing, you guys? Thank you so much for joining Tara's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for whoever needs to hear this at this time. Okay, let me just say this, okay? Whoever I'm speaking to, um, yeah, this ain't gonna resonate with everybody. So like I say, whoever I'm speaking to, honey, you're dealing with a wealthy man or what have you, or this wealthy man is coming into your life. I don't know why I always pick up on a wealthy man for my collective. I don't know why, but I do. But all I know is, is this wealthy man said, I'll make you fall in love with me. Okay. This person could be a smooth talker, what have you. They could be acting like as if they don't care or really showing any emotion. They trying to, you know, I don't know if it's something about you collective to the point where this person is unable to get you out of their head i don't know what you did to this individual y'all but honey this person said they want to make you fall in love with them or this is you okay put it where it fits you could be like i'll make you fall in love with me and this man could be acting like he don't care hmm but in actuality you the best he ever had what Ooh, we that's why. So you can put it on the move I'm talking to. Okay, anyway, yeah. Mmm. Wow. So yeah, so this person is saying that you're the best they ever had. This is why I can't stop thinking about you day and night, honey. Uh-huh. This person loves your soul because with Prince, you don't have to be beautiful. You know what I'm saying? For me to rock your what have you. You just have to have a beautiful soul. You just you know what I'm saying? And this person sees that in you. I don't know if you're dealing with this person. I know you already had sex with this individual, but you're that. Because uh, they're already saying you're the best they ever had. But if they, you guys haven't slept with this person yet or met this person, okay, it will be the best sex you ever had. All right. But, yeah, I don't know if this person is like, because we have here ain't no sunshine when she's gone. So this person was like, man, I don't know what would happen if this person wasn't in my life, if you weren't in their life. Because what I'm getting here, Collective, is that there's haters saying that you're not this, saying that you're not a good girl, okay? They're saying that you're really wicked, you just want this person for their money and shit like that. But really, you don't even need this person. You just want them. It's a difference between needing somebody and wanting them because you can take care of yourself and pay your own damn bills. You just want them for them. You feel me? Okay, so people haters are saying this and that, you know what I'm saying, or oh, whatever. So this person was like, man, you know, maybe this person did listen to these people for a little bit or what have you, okay? And it got it got to them, you know, maybe they was influenced by a couple of people, all right? But at the end of the day, you know, maybe they try to separate themselves or they try to block you out or what have you, but they can't get you out of their mind. It's something about you. It's something about your damn sex, too. Okay, you just blow this person's fucking mind, all right? Because they really see you for who you are, all right? And they noticing that people are jealous as fuck because maybe they want them for their own selfish fucking reasons. You know what I mean? So, yeah. But this person, I don't know if you ever been natural or you ever, you know, just put your, you know, show this person your full, complete self. I mean, like your soul, like you bared your soul to this person before. Uh, maybe you even took out the weave, honey, you even took out the track, you know, you even took off the makeup or what have you. This person has seen you bare, okay, because they love you natural. Huh? This person loves you natural. All right. They like the curly hair, but you got rock curly hair, short hair, whatever. Nappy hair, they don't care. They love you natural. Okay? Yes. I'm mid condition here. What could a man would I be if I treated, huh, you know what I mean, treated you unfaithfully? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm still underneath the weather, so excuse my voice. Okay. But yeah, so this person was like, what kind of man would I be if I just left you hanging, all right? If I ain't keep it 100, if I ain't keep it, you know, what's up here with you? All right, for others of y'all, this is for a few of y'all, small of y'all, but there is a mother figure here that does not like you, okay? Does not like you, all right? It says, my mother don't like you. So this is somebody's mother that probably don't like you. Maybe, you know how some of them uh, mothers be narcissists. They treat their son as if they're their man instead of treating them as their fucking son. You know what I mean? So that's the energy I'm getting from that, okay? So, uh-oh. And, um, yeah, so that's the energy I'm getting from that. Maybe the mother doesn't like you or for a um, small percentage of you. It could be a baby mother as well, okay? Yeah, let me adjust my camera one second. 
Yeah, yeah, my bad. But yeah, these people were talking about you behind your back, but you see that it came out in reverse. So if this mother figure, baby mama, or what have you, um, or just this could be sisters to whoever. All right, karmics or whatnot. You know, bitches that claim to be his friend but really like him on low key. You know what I'm saying? Um, was talking behind your back. He ain't listening to these hoes no more. I don't know if you said something about it. It was like, you know what? I feel uncomfortable by so and so and so. I know they don't really feel like me like they don't really deal with me like they don't really mess with me like that. So, you know, this you, you need to handle that for real. I'm seeing that some of you have bossed up. You're like, I'm getting that collective. It's like you you stepped up to this person. You probably let this person know. Hey, you better check these people. Okay, I'm 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 keeping it cordial and respectful, you know, out of the love of you. And a kind of, you know what I'm saying? Because if you don't handle it, I'm going to handle it. But I'm coming to you as a woman. Or I'm coming to you as a man. All right? I'm definitely getting that alpha male, alpha female energy coming from you guys. Whoever I'm speaking to. Okay? Yes, honey. This person here. Um, I don't know if these, these are third party situations that are interfering. Like I said, it does not have to be another female as far as somebody that's dealing with, I, this person is not dealing with nobody. All right. It's just third party situations, family members, or what have you, people, friends, whatever, um, that is into the situation. But guess what? They only see you though. They see you. Okay. It doesn't matter if they try to say you are a gold digger or what have you. All right, it's all good. Let people talk. We have the lovers here. This came out of nowhere. I wasn't even shuffling, honey. I wasn't even got dang on these cards. It just came out. I, I was like, what? So we have here. Look at this damn camera. God dang it. But yeah, so we have here the lovers card. Okay, you love this person. This person loves you. Look at that. This person could be wise as hell too. All right, some of you could be native. Some of you could be, um. I want to say the, um, let's see. Um, I'm just saying that. Oh, why? You, uh, shit. I ain't gonna say that. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, y'all could be a mixed chick, okay? This person could be, you know, black, what have you, have melanin, okay? But yeah, Latina, see si Latina, for my Latinas out there, okay? But yeah, all right? But some of y'all definitely biracial. Some of y'all are definitely, you know, um, could be dating someone of the different race, honey. That's more than beautiful, okay? We got to spread the love around, okay? But yes, honey. So this person could be a little bit older than you. There could be a gauge at um uh, age gap between y'all two for some of y'all as well. All right. But if this is not a Gemini, okay? But I'm definitely seeing that between the two of y'all. Like I'm definitely seeing two people here that are in love. But of course, with love, there's going to be motherfucking haters, okay? So hey, you know how that go. <laughs> you know how that go. All right. So that's just how I go. So hey. But I'm getting that you are alpha female, okay? And he's an alpha male, all right? And that's just what's going to happen with the territory. People going to hate. That's what they're going to do, all right? Let me see. Let me get a couple of these cards. Okay, it's my romance cards. Let's see. Yeah. So you love yourself. You had um, put down a boundary here. You have self-respect here. What I tell you, this person has some type of deception as far as not really showing their true colors here. And maybe they were deceiving themselves due to outside parties here. Yeah. I don't know if you guys spent some time away from each other or what have you. Okay. Due to this or what, you know, people, um, all up in y'all business here, okay? But I'm still seeing you guys get to know each other here, okay? Wow, this is your freaking soulmate. Wow. So this is your soulmate, all right? Something could have been going on with our finances and a career. And it says pay attention to the red flags, okay? Let me see why that's there. Pay attention to the red flags. Yeah, financial career reconciliation. Maybe somebody had to get their money right, okay? Maybe that was you or... I'm. What I'm getting with this is, because we have wealthy men here. So what I'm getting with this is that there could have been a lot of dependent people on this person. You know, this person could have took care of a lot of people. Anytime these family members or these people or friends were heavy that needed money, that was in and out, this person was right there to help them. Okay, I'm definitely getting that with that. Now this person is paying attention. Like, yeah, these people... These people just definitely wanted to um, have me around for their own benefits. They didn't want me to move on and give my all to this beautiful person because they wanted to use me, okay? That's what I'm getting, all right? Because you guys are passionate about each other, okay? You make each other happy, period, all right? Period. Yes, you called this person in. You ain't tripping. All right? Yes, here I see two people giving their relationship a chance. They're not allowing nobody, the outside parties, and none of that shit come in and disrupt this love, period. <laughs> Do you. 
All right? You deserve love. Clearly decide what you want to do. Some of you could be separated. This person is going to reach out to you. Believe that. Okay? And if you guys are back together, you're going to have a conversation about this too. And um, maybe somebody going to speak up, set some type of boundaries, and let you know about these people in their life. You better get rid of these motherfuckers. All right? What else? Can't make this up. Eight of Wands. Here's coming in. It's coming in, baby. Eight of Wands. Okay, yes. Two of Wands here. Okay, this is going to be smooth sailing, you guys. Moving forward. Page of Wands at the bottom of the deck. King of Cups. Wow. This person is in love with you. All right. Yeah. Okay. Six of Cups. Yep. Mm-hmm. Person come back in. Ooh. This person cut up. Um. Yeah, this, I'm getting this person is coming in because they don't want to miss this opportunity with you. Is what I'm saying. What I'm seeing here. All right. This is going to be a new start for being, for feeling stagnant, you guys. Or feel a stagnant from being disappointed is going to be a new start okay so this is what was going on behind the scenes this is why this person was acting like as if they didn't care because they really try to brush you off due to you know people saying and bringing out their motherfucking opinions and shit you know what i'm saying but don't worry about that okay i'm i'm getting to some of y'all was like nigga you better get your shelf together because uh one, well, one won't do another will <laughs> <laughs> but I'm seeing y'all come back together with this individual. This wealthy man, whoever this man is, this established man. Okay, let me, matter of fact, let me, get, let me see who it is. Let me see who it is. Who are these signs that's coming towards my collective? Who are these signs that's coming towards my collective? Virgo. Virgo. Some of y'all dealing with a Virgo. Who else? Sagittarius. Who else? Leo. Anybody else come out there? Nope. Okay. Who else? Okay, that's a Mercury placement. Cancer. Cancer. Who else? Capricorn. Let me get one more. Well, two more I wanted to come out. Okay. Scorpio. Gemini. All right, you guys. I love you guys so much. I will see you guys in the next reading. Bye.